It's a penultimate stage of the Absa Epic 2018, the world's premium mountain bike stage race. This incredible event traverses the Western Cape of South Africa, enjoying some of the best locations the country has to offer. The international field of pros and amateurs complete an identical course as teams of two in this unique eight-day adventure. Stage 6 is one of the easier stages of the Cape Epic this year. The riders will head out into the Velvet Pass trails and will tackle some challenging climbs, but will be rewarded with superb flowing single track. The total distance is just 76 kilometers, but there are 2,000 meters of climbing to deal with. Heading to the start line, currently in third overall, Cannondale Factory Racing, and in second, Canyon Topic, just four seconds separates them. The leaders by seven minutes and 15 seconds are Investex Songo specialized in the yellow zebra jerseys. The start gun goes, and the riders head out of Wellington into some of the finest trails in the world. Yaroslav Kulhavi and Howard Grotz have a significant lead, but anything can happen on the Cape Epic, and with the quality of the chasing teams, they cannot rest on their laurels. In the women's category, the top three are Silverback KMC, Ascendus Health, and current in the lead are Investec Songo Specialized in Orange. It's a cool start to the day, and the racing is fast. After yesterday's short time trial, the pro teams had a long recovery, and the pace is reflective of that. Even though they have almost 20 hours of racing in their legs, the top teams still have huge motivation for this stage. The first pressure point of the race is at 40 kilometers, where all the teams jostle for position to lead into the single track. If they're stuck behind the slower riders, then it's impossible to overtake. At the bottom of the green mumba climb, all the main protagonists are in attendance, Cannondale, Investec, Canyon and Buck. But it's the Czech-American combination of Kulhavi and Grotz that make the break and start to put some time on the rest of the field. They slowly pull away on the loose trails of the green mamba. Once in the single track, they put their foot down and keep stretching the gap. By the time they're at the 50 kilometer mark, they have one minute and 10 seconds on the chasing group. Cannondale try to stay within striking distance, but don't have the legs today. Trex Ellis and Marco 2 joins them and tries to reel in the leaders. Investex Songo Specialized, Kulhavi and Grotz have ridden a faultless race and crossed the line for their second win in a row. Trek Selis and Marco 2 manages to cross the line ahead of Cannondale Factory Racing to take second. Fumich and Avancini take third and jump to second in overall. Investex Songo Specialized increased their lead to almost eight and a half minutes. Just one team, Investex Songo Specialized, again dominate the women's category. Denmark's Annika Langville and American Kate Courtney proved to be untouchable by the rest of the field. They lead the race from start to finish and take their seventh win over the seven days. Third place goes to PMRA CST Racing, their first podium, second to Ascendus Health and Investec increased their lead to almost 47 minutes.